What's good, YouTube? DM Gaming here, guys. Man, man, man. What a time to be alive, guys. I want to start this video out by giving a big shout out to Bandy Namke. All right, Bandai Namco. So they got a thing going on. Over the next 10 weeks, we'll be featuring up and coming creators covering our October game launches. To be considered, make sure you're using the right game tags on YouTube and Twitch for Sword Art Online, Fractured Daydream, Unknown Nine, and what we're all here to talk about, Dragon Ball Sparking Zero. And that is 100 creators under 100K. Your boy DM Gaming qualifies for that, so Ben that damn co, holla at your boy. Man, wouldn't it be cool to get a shout out from them? Um, so, I mean, guys, okay. I know on the channel, I've been covering college football, talked some Black Myth Wukong, but the majority of us here on this channel know what's up. We talk Dragon Ball, okay? And I gotta say this, man. I freaking did it. I did it. I tried to wait, y'all. I could not wait. I did it. I did it. It is what it is. Guys, man. Sparking Zero. So, oh, man. Oh, man. Y'all, um, subscribe to the channel, Okay. Don't be a point dexter, get out the portal, become five star or seven star in the Dragon Ball sense. Subscribe to the channel, turn the bell icon so you don't miss a single upload. <sighs> Guys, I've been covering Sparking Zero for people that was like, Where's Sparking Zero content? It's on here. Okay, we got a playlist here with 21 videos dating all the way back to freaking last year. Tink, it was Tinkaichi 4 at the time, that's what we was calling it. Guys, this is my go-to video, man. I bring this up all the time because I told y'all. I freaking told y'all. This ain't even the old other one. There's an older video that's not. I'm going to add it to this playlist, by the way. Okay. Telling y'all that, that, that the next Dragon Ball game on next-gen console would be exclusive to next-gen console. And it would be on the Unreal Engine 5. It would be legit. -y. And we here. Beat your chest. So, uh, go check out the playlist, y'all. Bandai Namco, go check out my playlist. Um, I also have covered Kakarot extensively on this channel. What were my Kakarot? How many videos have we covered on Dragon Ball Z Kakarot? 682 videos on Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. Okay. I have to digress. Guys. I finally did it, okay? I, 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 I watched some gameplay of Sparkin Zero, and I dang near went Super Saiyan, okay? I dang near went freaking Super Saiyan. I'm ready for this game. I, I, I'm not going to lie to y'all. At first, I was, I, I've been excited about it. We've talked about it on the channel and stuff like that, but... I'm, I'm not going to sit here and tell y'all that I've been covering it every day like I did Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. I didn't. Okay? Because to me, with Sparking Zero, what you see is kind of what you get. Ah, I was wrong. I was very wrong. And that's fine. Because wrong in this instance is good. The reason why, one thing I thought, or, you know, th this game, I, t I, t I said it in the last video. It feels like a combination between Raging Blast 2, uh, uh, Budokai, and then Budokai Tenkaichi with some little splash of Xenoverse in there and, 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 a, and a little tittle tittle, a little tittle tittle of Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. Y'all, I look at this game and all combat aside, this game is effing beautiful with a capital beautiful, okay? This game looks so freaking gorgeous oh my gosh my dragon balls you know what i'm saying this game looks phenomenal and i told y'all i told y'all with the unreal engine 5 it was going oh my gosh man like i sit here i haven't watched like story mode stuff i haven't watched um i've seen like the outline of how they do the creative episode things which by the way guys Subscribe to the channel because I'm 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 going to create my own series. It is already in writing as we speak. I'm at, yeah I'm actually start the writing today as we speak. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and start writing a script for it. Okay. Um, I gotta go look and see what all characters are available and stuff like that, and then you know kind of go from there. 
Uh, but I'm going to be creating my own episodes. So give me time because I mean, I don't even lie. Looking at like the episode creation thing, it 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 seems like it can be a bit overwhelming. So it's going to take some a little bit of time for me to get my hands on it, get used to it and find my groove. But I promise you and I, and I guarantee you other creators are going to be doing the same. So it's going to be really, really fun to see like people come up with their own movies and episodes and sagas and things like that. I cannot wait to bring y'all that content. So please subscribe to your boy, man. Do your boy a solid. Don't cost y'all nothing at all. You know what I'm saying? And then uh, for the most part, I've just been watching people fight. And as big of a open world guy that I am, I love Dra I love Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. Can we get some more DLC for that? I'm sitting here watching this game, and I don't know why, guys. I do this every time a new Dragon Ball game comes out. You see it, and you're like, dang, I wish we had that in this Dragon Ball game. Does that make sense? I wish we, the way that the fighting is and looks in, in Sparking Zero, Boy, I'm telling you, if we had that, the same combat system, the Unreal Engine 5, the smashing through everything around you type stuff, bro, take the combat, take the design of this game and, and lift it up into the heavens to Omega Shinron, to, to Super uh, Supreme Shinron and drop it into Dragon Ball Z Kakarot. And I tell you what, oh my God. Because that is the thing that I am most impressed with is how this game looks, how it plays. Bro, like they flying through the air. It's, it's so smooth. It is so freaking smooth. And they do a really nice job of showing like when people get knocked through mountains, when people get knocked back through the air. Like it's it's weird to say, but you can you can almost feel the force of a powerful blow you know what i'm saying them flying around it is so crisp this game is crispity crispy smooth oh my gosh and 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 i'm gonna be honest with y'all i'm glad that i kind of just now started watching gameplay i'm not spoiled on the story mode don't spoil me on that i haven't looked at any of that and then like i said as far as the character the creation stuff the episode creation thing, I've seen an outline of how they do it. Um, other than that, like I said, I've only watched people fighting. And I'm glad I waited till now. Because I ain't gonna lie to y'all. If I had have watched all of that before, oh my gosh. And, and I'm happy because I, I have watched limited fights. Okay, it, it's, it's not to the point of like it was for us with Xenoverse, with Dragon Ball Z Kakarot and other previous Dragon Ball games where they pretty much show you everything. People getting the game early and showing everything. I am so glad because I know that I'm still going to go into this game. I haven't even watched the training mode because I think I've seen a video that was talking about they, they, was, they, was, they were showing the training mode. I'm so glad. I ain't even watched that. So I do know how to play the Tenkaichi games. But as far as the game mechanics and things like that, I, I'm still clueless on. Do not spoil that for me, okay? Because I want to go in this game as blind as possible. And and I'm to that point. Because, yeah, you are you see trailers, you're seeing gameplay, essentially. You know what I'm saying? But, man, I'm uber excited for this after watching the fights. And I'm so glad to be going into it blind because I don't know what to expect. I haven't... Uh, I haven't seen fights to the sense of knowing everybody's moves and this and that. Now, one, of the, one thing that I did see that I was very happy about that I was wrong about was remember last video where I talked about how the characters, you know, oh, there's 100 characters, blah, 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 68 characters, 108 characters, whatever. And, and you know me, I've never been into a, into it where it's like, bro, we got 30 million different copies of Goku, 7 million copies of Gohan and Vegeta, you know, and, but they all fight differently. One thing that I'm liking that I really, really love that they did that does make things different is each, if I have a Goku, base Goku has different attacks than Super Saiyan Goku, than Super Saiyan 2 and Super Saiyan 3, Ultra Instinct. I love that. 
to me, yes, at that point, it makes it a different character. I love that I can transform and I'm going to have a different move list because Super Saiyan Goku doesn't fight the same as base level Goku. So, <laughs> Xenoverse 2, why would you give them the same attacks? Actually, no, I think Xenoverse 2 does give them different. No, 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 no. It gives them the same attacks. It, it changes their ultimate attacks, maybe. I don't know, I'm not even sure if Xenoverse does that. I haven't played Xenoverse in a long time. But I like this because it reminds me of Raging Blast 2. How whenever you transform, you got different attacks and things like that. So there would be a reason to play with a base level and, and a, a transform state and things like that. I am in love with that. Um, now, are we able to customize that? I don't know. Do not tell me. I want to find out when I play the game. But I know somebody going to say something. So it is what it is at this point. Kind of open the door. For that, whenever I said don't, anytime you tell people not to do something, it seems like that's what we want to do. But I have to digress. I, I'm, I'm excited about that. I'm excited about that. That makes me feel so much better. And then also, I, I did see something to where, for example, if you have two characters that can fuse, like Trunks and Goten. If they fuse, they're going to have a health bus bump. Okay, they're going to gain health by fusing into Gotenks. The more health they have when they fuse, the more health Gotenks will have. And you're going to have more health that way than if you just pick Gotenks already fused. So there's benefit, people. There's benefit in picking a character unfused and then fused in the game. Okay. Um, I'm wondering, is that going to be the tail of the tape for other things, other transformations and stuff? You know, so... All in all, guys, I'm stoked. You know, I I, I I planned on waiting till the 11th because, I mean, from what I've seen, this is going to be playable at like 5 o'clock p.m. Central Time on Tuesday. Uh, the reason for me waiting would be because I'm not going to be able to play it till like Friday morning and then Saturday because I coach football and I teach. And Tuesdays, I might get home at 8 o'clock, okay? Um, Wednesday, this Wednesday, I ain't going to be home till late. We got a bonfire for homecoming, and it'll probably be another 8, 9 o'clock night. Thursday, Thursday, we got we got middle school ball games. And, and, and this Thursday, guys, we got to go pretty far. We got to go to Quinlan Bowes, and it's like 25 minutes from from Rockwall, Texas. It's close to that. It's like an hour and a half drive or, or longer. Okay? We got to go all the way there. And then Friday, of course, it's a home game. It's homecoming. So I'll have some time. I, I'm making time for this game. Okay? I am making time for this game. Tuesday, I'm sorry. I'm I'm a rest up all Monday. I'm, I'm Tuesday, I'm getting off. I, I'm, a, I'm hoping my coins come through because if they do... I'm getting the game. I'm getting the game three days early. I don't feel like waiting. But in the event that my coins do not come through, then it, 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 we, we got to find a way. We'll find a way. But, you know, I'm not big on getting it three days early. Um, I would love it. Bandai Namco, hintity hint, hint, if you sent your boy a copy, like you sent me the Dragon Ball Z Kakarot thing, that'd be dope. But I don't, I don't know. You know, it is what it is. People got to work. Teachers got to teach. Coaches got to coach at the end of the day. But I will be on it this weekend. Saturday, I may just live stream. Okay, guys, let me know if you would like to see a live stream this weekend. Saturday, possibly Sunday, you know, getting on the sticks, playing some Sparking Zero. I ain't going to be playing with y'all. Don't even, don't even sit there and be like, DM, come play with us. Mm -mm. I got to get used to the game first. Y'all not finna have me hopping on the sticks, getting dropped off on my own stream. That that ain't happening. But we do got to get back to the live streams and stuff like that, guys. Um, other than that, man, I'm excited. I am uber excited for this game. Haven't decided what edition I'm going to get yet. I, I think the ultimate deluxe. I mean, the ultimate uh, digital or whatever. Uh, since it's only like, well, I think the premium. I, I don't know. We'll see. I, I know I, I ain't getting a physical copy, but that's fine. I don't need a physical copy. Vegeta is probably going to be my main. I'm so excited to play with my boy Vegeta. Whew, y'all. I'm excited now. I'm, I'm fired up for this game. I cannot wait till next week to get my hands on it. 
and just see it in its glory and splendor on my television. Because, you know, YouTube, I think, you know, it looks good on YouTube. But seeing it in person, whoo and I got the Elgato finally do yes, sir. Guys, hype level is beyond 9,000. It's overflowing, okay? Let me know what y'all think. Who's Matter of fact, who's going to be y'all's main? Who are you going to main in this game? And, 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 and what are you most looking forward to with this anime gaming game breaking bro they this more this game is already sold more copies than call of duty okay it, it might be game of the year this or black myth wukong i tell you what i don't know let me know what y'all think down in the comment section down below guys till next time y'all thanks for watching peace